So first I'm going to take my base color and I'm using Mrs. O'Leary's Barbecue from OPI. And I just painted two coats of that on my nails. And then I'm taking a glitter polish and I'm using Julep's color, which is called Yumi. And it's like a holographic pink color. So I just wiped off most of the polish off of the nail polish brush. And then I'm going to, in layers, apply the glitter polish to my ring finger as an accent nail. So I'm starting off with hardly anything on the brush. And I made sure to start at the tip of my nail just to make sure that there weren't any clumps that would mess up the design. So I'm just really lightly applying the glitter to the midsection of my nail and then um, working downward for the first layer. So then I put more polish on the brush and I'm taking that on the lower part, probably the lower third of my nail and trying to make that as opaque as possible without making it too thick because that'll just peel off when you're done. So this is the final result. And you can also do this with a more shimmery nail polish. Uh, this one is Butter London's color called Wallace. And it's a nice olive color and I thought it went well with the purple. So wipe off as much as you can and repeat the same process. This is a little bit harder um, if you're not using a glitter polish because it shows mistakes more easily. And as you can see, this was with my left hand, so it was really hard for me to do it. But with some practice, it can look really good. So lastly, you just want to apply a top coat, and I'm using this Sally Hansen Insta Dry Fast Drying Top Coat, and this one is really um, kind of gloopy because it needs to be replaced, so I did the best that I could with that, but that is what your nails will look like with a top coat, and I think it's really cute if you just do an accent nail, or you can do your entire hand like that. So thank you for watching.